Welcome back to the Frugal Gardener's Garden. It's a windy day in the garden. It's actually late February. For those of you who follow my channel, you wouldn't be surprised to see this potato. It is starting to spud. Uh, for most people, people who don't garden, they would probably cut this off and throw it away. I use these to grow more potatoes. For me, this is free potatoes. Now, I have a problem. I'm going to take a negative and turn it into a positive. Sound like a pit bull there. At any rate, I planted, I, I've been cutting these off during the winter. I have quite a few potatoes like this. And I have been putting those in the soil as a means of keeping them dormant until the spring so that I can plant them. But, as you know, if you follow my channel, I'm not always the best when it comes to marking things. So, I put a bunch of these in a white container like this, which I have several of, and because I got confused, I put this in with my um, <clears throat> grow lights and this is what happened <laughs> of course the potatoes thinks it's spring between the heat lamp and the um, the mat this is uh, what I have now so what am I going to do I'm going to try and play along I mean this is uh Another experiment. This was an unintended experiment. You can tell by the way these are not arranged that this was a temporary situation where I was going to take these out, spread them out, and plant them properly in the proper soil. So, I was talking to my nephew yesterday and I showed him and you kind of confirm what I was already thinking, which is just roll with it. Just play along and see what happens. Last year, I planted one potato, pretty much like this one here. One potato in a container exactly like this one. And I got quite a few potatoes out of that one potato. And... What I'm going to do is post the link down to the bottom of this video so that you can check it out if, you, if you're so inclined. At any rate, I'm looking at huh, roughly a dozen uh, potato, I guess you can call them slips, that are down in here. And it's a nice day outside today. Well, I guess you can say it's nice because it's in the 60s but it is overcast it has been raining so I decided to come out and make this video and this is going to go back into the house back under my um, my lamp and back on my heating pad I'm not sure how much heat I'm going to get because this is pretty deep this is uh, close to I don't know 10 inches so like I said it seems to be working if it does work out, then this is something you guys might want to try. At any rate, here it is. And um, I have a maybe a sneak preview underneath this plastic is my latest addition to my garden, which is going to save my back. I'll talk about that in a future video. But right now, I just wanted to show you this and let you know what I was up to. I'm getting ready for spring and I'm going to do a couple of videos on what I am doing to get ready for spring and maybe you may try to uh, get a few things done yourself. This is the Frugal Gardener. Thanks for stopping by and remember when you grow your own food you'll always know where it comes from. Post your questions and comments below. I appreciate it. I appreciate you. You guys have a great day.